It's now been two days since the first viewer study was released, and I believe I have enough comments to, well, I believe I has, have as many comments as I'm going to get on that video. So, here's the results. The question was, did picture A or picture B get taken before the other one? Which one came first, in other words? Because they were taking a week and a half apart, about, and most of you said B before A. One said A before B. That was Redneck Byron, or Redneck Bri um, Brian, sorry. Redneck Brian was the only one that got it right. Everybody else got it wrong. So this is interesting. I believe it's because I've been sli getting slightly more tanned. And I had, and I'm kind of getting a little, I guess you could say sunburn, but slight redness. I, I don't even think it's sunburn. I think it's just like a, a suntan because I've been going bicycle riding a lot. So I'm thinking that might be uh, changing the, the uh, me between the days. See, some people were like, you're not going to notice any change. It's like, well, this isn't to notice change. This is to notice a non-change because if I keep doing this, if I keep having viewer studies, there's going to be just like random flip-flopping of little things, but then it'll start being more and more, okay, we know it's obvious what it is. And so it'll be very interesting to see at what point does most people say the right answer? At what point does just one day getting a better shave or one day getting less tanned or one day my skin being a little lighter or whatever doesn't have that much effect over knowing which was taken before the transition or during the transition. So that's, yeah. So it's pretty interesting how, how big of an effect even the little stuff seemed to have over these pictures. Now, also, I, I want to address how to answer the user study. Some people didn't seem to be doing it the way, the way that I think would be best. I think that just don't put too much thought into it. Because some, some people were, were commenting on videos after that, like, man, I still really don't know which one, to, wh which one came first. It's like, no, you're thinking about it too much. I just want you to like just look at it because our, our, our brains are really great. They are wonderful at detecting faces. So just look at it and think, and if you, if you have an answer like, oh, I think B became B before A, yeah, it sounds about right. And just, just your first instinct and just throw it out on the comments because it's kind of interesting. I, I always love this about, about YouTube, especially when I have a lot of comments because sometimes the average will be correct or or the average will be leaning towards one side or the other whether it be misled by you to uh, by like internet myths like about batteries i've run into that a lot on my cha on my main channel because people keep talking about stupid things about batteries that they don't know what they're talking about that's a whole other rant for a different day oh well i've already got off topic with this oh well but yeah very interesting that a small change had such a big impact on the answers of, pe of people. And I would say if, whenever I do a future, uh, future ones of these, don't think too much about your answer. Just like your first guess because it's not that important. Okay? Well, I thank you very much for answering the, uh, that question. This information will be really interesting, especially whenever I do it several times, like every two weeks or every month or whatever, and I slowly compound the, the data into like a graph, because that would be pretty cool. Well, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching. Can't wait to see you till the next viewer study. See ya!